And they feature one of these guys on the news and they bring in Stefan to come. And, you know, I mean, I'm sure you were concussed after the death blow that, that you received or the chi ball. Yeah, they came your way. But Stefan, he was just like, yeah, I feel nothing. Yeah, no, no, no. I, I think he's lying. It was it was so uncomfortable watching it from my couch. I couldn't imagine. Oh, man. I felt so bad for that guy. He came to our, <laughs> I think he came to Jeff Neal's class. He came to our jujitsu school. And um, <laughs> my girlfriend who worked for Fox News made that story. She produced it. So Phenomenal. she's like, Phenomenal. she went to his school, right? And all his students are flopping like fish. So she's like, but we're going to put this to the test. We'll see if it really works. We'll go to my boyfriend's jujitsu school and you try it on them guys. And I remember feeling bad for him because um, this one uh, guy way smaller than me, a little Asian guy was like, does it work? Because um, he, he was doing this move where you put me in a standing arm bar, like one of these, like twist, like one of these type of arm bars. And it only works um, if, you know, if, if I'm not, if I'm, if this hand's unlocked from you, if this hand's not touching you, I'm not intercepting your chi. So if you put me in that and I go like this and touch you at the same time, you can't get it. And I'm like, no, because I don't have the leverage. I need your shoulders in a straight line to get the leverage on you, you know, because he, he's like, put me in it. And he's doing this and I'm like squaring his shoulders up. So, of course, I can't do it on him, you know. So I remember th thinking like, well, no, you're doing that. So I really like stepped back and wrenched it and got it to work and. And I felt a little bad about that because um, he's like an <laughs> older, heavy set guy. And like, I, I didn't know he sold all these videos and like <laughs> really thought he could do this stuff. Like I thought he was just trying to show me something and, and like, you know, I'm trying to show him that like, it's bullshit. And then one of the students goes, oh, could, does it work against arm bars on the ground? Oh yeah, of course. So go ahead, put me in an arm bar on the ground, right? Now I'll go ahead and intercept your chi Ready? Go. And then, of course, he popped the guy's arm and ah, and he let go. And, and uh, my girlfriend's actually like pretty nice. She didn't put, she could have made him look so much worse, but she didn't even put that in the video, but she showed that it didn't work. So, yeah, this guy was thinking he could knock you out without touching you and these no touch knockouts. And it was so funny because he's doing them at his school, like throwing fireballs, like, here in Street Fighter, his students are flying and flopping like fish, you know? Like, that goes to show me, it's like, were those guys serious? Is it like that, like, psychosomatic that, like, they were so affected, they believed in it so much that they'd have those reactions? Or are they playing along with them? Like, even to this day, like, I don't know the answer to that question. But, like, God knows it doesn't work, like, <laughs> at all. Check out the full interview on iTunes, Spotify, and all major podcast platforms.